We're doing the Learn CSS box model by building a Rothko painting on FreeCodeCamp. Uh, we're on step 24. So let's create a new CSS rule using the two selector. Um, so that was the div that we just created and set its width to 475 um, pixels, like so. Perfect. So step 25, set the height of the two elements to 200 pixels. So height is 200 pixels. And I'm guessing we'll do a background color. Yep, background dash color. And that's going to be this hex code here. So I'm just going to copy and paste that. There we go. Cool. And we can see this is our second div uh, or a second uh, rectangle now. <clears throat> So center the two element by setting its margin to auto. So let's do margin auto. There we go. And step 28, create a new div with a class value of three. So div class equals three. And we'll cl then close off that div. That's going to be the third rectangle. <clears throat> create a new rule dot three. And again, set its width to now 91%, like so. And step 30, set the height to 28%. So, oops. And I'm guessing again, third time, we'll be setting a background color. So there we go. Background dash color of the three div, and that's gonna be this hex code. So I'm just gonna copy and paste it. And now down here, we can see our third div. Cool. So step 23, center the three element by setting its margin as well to auto. There we go, that's moved over. <clears throat> and step 33, it will be helpful to have your margins push in one direction. So in this case, the bottom margin of the one pushes the two down 20 pixels. Um, in the two selector, using the margin shorthand property, set the top margin to zero, the horizontal margin to auto, and the bottom margin to 20 pixels. Um, and I think that is how that all works there. And that's sort of the shorthand for setting three properties. Perfect. And finally, step 35, the colors and shapes of your painting are too sharp to pass as a Rothko. Um, use the filter property to blur the painting by two pixels. So here's an example of how you use the filter. Um, and we want to add that to the canvas, which is this one. So it will just be filter and that will be blur and then two pixels like so. And there we go, that's blurred. And that's why actually, I guess at the very start, um, the image did look blurry, but not in the border. Uh, I guess that is the, the style of a Rothko. So learning a little bit of art as well as CSS. Cool, so that's all probably for this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.